The cinema is public and private schools meeting with the COVID-19 task force to open their doors safely with a hybrid approach. Lieutenant Governor Arnold Palacios. Take all and put all the necessary precautions and environment that needs and protocols that needs to be in place. Mount Carmel School President Dr. Gavin DeLeon Guerrero says safety is top of mind. The challenge is to come up with a standardized set of guidelines that keep our students safe, but also empower their different institutions uh, to customize what they are going to do. They're looking at behavior, environment, operations, response, and communication. While we're trying to keep our students physically healthy, we're also trying to keep them socially and emotionally healthy. That mission shared by Public School System Commissioner Dr. Alfred Ada, who noted some possible plans. The hybrid remote and offsite learning is about in-person learning in small groups with staggered schedules, with block and tracking schedules. It's also a four-day work week for our teachers, uh, considering we are still in the uh, cold blue current status. They're also implementing plans to expand access to laptops, Wi-Fi, and free lunches. Testing for employees is also in the works. Concerns from families are being heard. Students that are at high risk or they have family members at high risk should not be penalized for not uh, failing to attend school. Or if parents um, are still feel uneasy about sending their child to school, we uh, are going to go ahead and give them the remote, uh, remote support. That support for a back-to-school season like never before. Tomas Maglonia for KUAM News on Saipan.